When sending through elements you require in your banner design to us at Mesh Direct, there are a few things that we request in order to optimize the print quality of your design. I'm going to show you how to identify whether your logo is a vector file or not. Now, vector art is created using vector illustration software. We use Adobe Illustrator, but they can also be created on CorelDRAW. Adobe Illustrator is more common. These programs use geometric primitives, um, points, lines and shapes to create art that can be scaled infinitely without losing quality. The first thing that you want to check is the file type of your logo file. So a vector file will never be a .png or a .jpeg file. These will always be raster or pixel based files. Another way to check is just to open your file in any preview program. I like to use Adobe Acrobat because it allows me to zoom in a lot more and on a percentage scale. Now when I've opened this file, I can already see that it's going to pixelate. When you zoom in, let's say to 500%, you can see that it's definitely pixelated. These are not the files that you want to use to print grand format because it just lessens the quality of the print. If it can be avoided, we want to, we, we don't want to send through non-vector artwork. Now I'm going to show you the difference when you open a vector file. So in this case I have a PDF file. They can also be .eps or .ai files. So when we open this in our preview document, I can already tell that these lines are plain. If you zoom in to a thousand percent, there's no pixelation at all. Checking the file type isn't foolproof. It is possible to open non-vector art in a program such as Adobe Acrobat and save a file as a PDF file. This is why we have the method of checking in your actual preview program. So even though I know that this file will pixelate and it's a JPEG. When I close this down, I can save it and it will save as a PDF. If you're unsure, just check in your